what's up my water signs i'm back thank you guys for watching my channel she's got the gift cancer pisces scorpios what's up y'all thank you for your likes your comments and your subscribes please take the parts that resonate with you okay the pieces that belong to your puzzle and leave the rest of the pieces for everybody else if you're seeking a personal at this time, I am just an email away, Cancer Pisces and Scorpio. That could be found in my script, description box below. Okay, that's where I'll post it. Also, what could be found in my description box below is I know you cannot help but to see this beautiful rose company. Yep, that goes by the name Rose Forever. Look, go ahead and smell. Mm-hmm. Yes, y'all. Something about the color blue that's just like triggering for me this week. Yeah, I see the nails or whatever. But they have amazing sales and discounts going on. I suggest you guys check them out while the sales is going on. This company is very expensive, but they have the right to be. It speaks for themselves. Um, also, I have a discount code for you that will be pinned in my description box below. Okay, it's GIFT25, G-I-F-T with the number 25, and you'll receive additional 25% off on top of all the goodies and, and um, discounts they got get going on too. Okay, so take advantage of that. Thank you, Rose. We really appreciate you. We're going to jump right into it with True Cancer. Spirit, white light, holy angels, I call upon you to guide me. Thank you for using me as a vessel. I'm grateful. Protect me at this time. Block out all negativity. No weapon being formed to go against me and my foundation. The collective Scorpio, Cancers, and Pisces Foundation shall prosper. Rebuke all black magic, evil entity, and spell work being sent, please, and thank you. Messages for Cancer at this time, Spirit. Messages for Cancer. The Two of Wands. You got somebody on your mind. A decision needs to be made here. You could be dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Look at this Eight of Swords here. It's in reverse. Yeah, something, something that you want to go towards or a decision you need to want to make, need to make here or feel like making with the Eight of Swords showing up in reverse. No ifs and buts about it. You already know what you need to do. Show me more. The Emperor. Oof. Bossing up, showing somebody who you really are. This person coming towards you is a boss, baby. But let's see, what's going on with this decision here for, for cancer spirit? You could be dealing with the Aries. You just stepping out of your comfort zone here and becoming this entrepreneur that you know is with inside of you. Like you opening and unlocking your fullest potential at this time. What's the decision about spirit with the two of wands? Ooh, ace of wands. Whew. About you on a fire sign or something, something hot here, steamy. Show me more. A passionate idea here. Show me more. The wheel of fortune. Yeah, your turn is now. Something is unlocking for you. You got to make that step. Page of swords. You got somebody watching you do this, though. You got somebody watching you unlock your potential. The wheel is in your favor here. Something about good luck with this business endeavor you got going on this passionate idea it's gonna it's gonna take off you don't you don't expect it to but it is and you got somebody watching your progress why is this eight of swords here showing it in reverse something was something was like uh overbearing to you or like you were sabotaging something at one point this could be a uh, libra gemini or an aquarius here that's watching you with this eight, eight of swords in reverse with this page of swords four of wands here it's like you know what you want to do. You know where you're going. It's a, this is about a new home as well, or like some type of um, union. Look at the decision comes with leaving someone out in the cold. The five of pentacles. You could be dealing with the Taurus, a Virgo, or a Capricorn that you have to leave behind in order for this potential to unlock within yourself. This person could have had you in your head about a lot of things here. Yeah, the Four of Pentacles. It's about your wealth. It's about your next move. Making your next move your best move, Cancer. That's all that is. Somebody tried to hold you back. It could be an air sign that tried to hold you back or earth sign. Taurus, Lego, Capricorn, Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius that try to keep you confused or stuck in an illusion, but you already know what you need to do. What's this emperor about here? This could be about your boss. This could be your boss that was doing this, holding you back. Or somebody just wanting to be in control of every fucking thing. You, you're getting away from it. Look, you could be walking away from another water sign, another Cancer, a Pisces, or a Scorpio. But you walking away here is definitely going to open up something. 88 is significant. A couple of you could have been born in 88. 588 is someone's uh, number as well. First three. You becoming a boss. Are you unlocking your full potential here, uh, Cancer? They want you to know you have to leave something behind. 
This is when something else is going to open up for you. Thank you, spirit angels. Yeah, the hanged man. You need to realize who you are. You need to realize the people that you're around is only holding you back here. They're slowing down your progression in life, okay? So that's what they want you to know at this time. You could be dealing with the Aries or another Cancer Pisces Scorpio, but this person needs to be let go of so that you can move on with your life. There's a new cycle beginning and your name is written on it and good luck as well. But once you let go of what no longer serves you, okay? Love you, Cancer. Don't forget to hit the like, the comment, and subscribe button. What's up, Pisces? Oh, Pisces. Oh, Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Pisces, spirit. Messages for Pisces at this time. Letting bygones be bygones, huh? Exploring your options. You fantasizing a lot, too, right now. Show me messages for Pisces, spirit. Pisces. Pisces. Hanged man. Mm -hmm. Starting all over. Starting all over here. Page of swords. Watching somebody, learning somebody, strategizing somebody. Somebody sizing you up. That's exactly what I just heard. Give me one more for Pisces. They gave you two here. The moon card here and uh, the king of cups showed up in reverse. You could be dealing with a cancer or another Pisces here, but you're figuring out and coming to a conclusion that this person does not love you the way they say you are. That they, they, they do not love you the way they say they love you here. Strong on a water sign. You could be dealing with in a relationship with another water sign. What's the fool about here? This could go one or two ways. You being a you being a fool here and accepting something and going for something you know you should have been let go of. Are you taking that leap of faith and going towards somewhere else? Okay, so let's see. What's the fool about spirit for Pisces? Fool for Pisces. Clarify the fool for Pisces, please. Thank you. Six of Wands. Moving on. Moving on. You finna get patronized too. Somebody see you. Somebody sees your worth. They know what you good. Look, I told you. Look. A uh, two of cups, a partnership here. As soon as you let go of something, something else opens up for you. Moving on to something new, better here. This is you. You running into your soulmate. The fool card, the six of wands with the two of cups. You're determined to meet the one for you, and it's coming. What's this page of swords? They, this could be talking about you learning something, you starting from scratch, and also I feel like someone is watching, learning you. Show me more. The sun, it could be a Leo that's watching you, learning something from you. But this is some type of exposure. So that whoever's watching you in a the cut, they will be exposed for it. Ace of Pentacles, but I caught it. Give me a little bit more. Thank you, Will of Fortune. Mm -hmm. This could be any uh, fixed sign. It's strong Leo here that's watching you, but it could be a Scorpio, an Aquarius, or a Taurus here. Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius, or Taurus that's watching you, but you will be you will be shown here. Luck is in your favor. Luck is turning here. It's some type of secret or something you don't know about that's getting ready to come out. So you got you running into somebody new here. You finna meet new love, so don't worry about it. Take that leap of faith. You got somebody watching you, but they will be exposed. And then here comes some secrets being revealed. Show me more, spirit. Page of Pentacles here. Yeah, somebody's coming up with something. Show me more. The devil here to keep you stuck to him show me more about this this could be a capricorn or another pisces with the moon showing up aquarius as well seven of pentacles and the star somebody got hope or like somebody somebody's hoping you take them back they trying to come up with something here a plan to get you back but they real toxic as a motherfucker and you know they come with a whole bunch of bullshit attached to them so they say keep the faith and move forward that goes back to the fool here keep it pushing this person don't mean you no good they want to keep you stuck to them, bound to them, but they ain't got nothing going on. They're coming up as a page of pentacles. They don't even know they self Pisces. This person don't love your, them. They don't even love you. They don't love themselves and they don't love you. Why is this king of cups here showing up in reverse for Pisces? Why is this king of cups here showing up in reverse for Pisces? Why is this in reverse? Death here, it's over with. You could be dealing with a Scorpio, a water sign strong out here. Aquarius 2 and Capricorn is strong. Leo 2. Show me more. The moon here again. End it because this motherfucker is not no good. If it's not one thing, it's another with this person. One last card on this person. Five of Pentacles. Leave that motherfucker at the door. He do not access granted. Do not pass go. Do not collect $200 with this person, okay? I'm leaving it there. I love you, Pisces. This is what I have for you. You could be having to leave out a Scorpio here or a Cancer. Strong on a Cancer or another Pisces. I meant to say Pisces with the moon. Mm. 
whatever the secret is that's being revealed here or whoever this person is that's planning something to keep you stuck to them, they will be shown to you. Somebody is watching you, learning you like a motherfucker. It could be a Leo, but they want something that you got. They're trying to be you. It'll never work because that's not their destiny. It's yours. Don't forget to hit the like, comment, and subscribe button, Pisces. What's up, Squirt? Scorpio spirit. Messages for Scorpio. Scorpio, this won't be long because you have a date coming out also, okay? And I want you to pin in the comments if I should got, if I should do you guys a singles read. I don't know how many of my Scorpios are single on here on my channel, okay? So pin it if you are. Let me know. And I'll get that out to you as well to see what's going on with the singles. Scorpio spirit. Scorpio. Scorpio. Scorpio's energy spirit. Messages for Scorpio. They said one more shuffle. All right. Messages for Scorpio at this time, spirit. Messages for Scorpio. Ten of Cups here. Ooh. You make me better. Um, some news that's coming in is gonna make you real happy. Ten of Cups with the Eight of Wands. Show me more. There's a celebration, a birthday party that you're gonna uh, get invited to. The fool here. Um, your challenge uh, card here is the nine of wands. Wounded warrior, you've been through something before. Mm. Six of wands here at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, somebody been through some shit here, but they feel like you, you are their soulmate, or this who you really supposed to be with. You supposed to go through something, or let's figure it out. Let's get down to the bottom of it. What you, what's going on for Scorpio spirit? What's this ten of cups about? This could have something to do with your family, your upbringing. A birthday party is coming up. A sibling with a birthday party or something like that. What's this uh, Ten of Cups about, Spirit? What's going on with this Ten of Cups? You just being happy overall here. Ten of Pentacles here. Ace, ooh, wait, Ace of Cups here. And a Temperance. Whoever this is, it could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, a Sagittarius, or another water sign that's coming towards you here. To pour into you, to express their heart, to express their feelings, to show you love. To, to like make you grounded whoever this is is well off stable here okay they know what they want and they've been patient about it and they've been guided to come towards you there's some here come the communication so you know this is this could be a water sign here a sagittarius or a taurus virgo capricorn but here come the communication from this person what's this eight of wands about spirit the magician, Lord her mercy. The magician, it could be from a Gemini or a Virgo. This communication is coming in. Yeah, Eight of Wands, double communication. It could be from two people, a Gemini and a Virgo here. This is about an offer that's coming in to you. The Knight of Pentacles, it could be a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. Five of Pentacles. Somebody is left out here. Whoever is going, whoever was left out is coming back. But I feel like this is also another form of communication. This wanted to pop out. I hope that you can forgive me one day. So whoever you walked away from, they re they wanted to read. They would. They ready. They ready. They willing. They want to put the work in. But you got double confirmation here. Somebody could be born in 88. Show me show me this eight of wands here. It's, it, it's coming from two people. One you left out and then one is another silent offer. What's this other eight of wands about spirit? Two of pentacles. Six of, six of cups. Somebody from your past that put you through a lot. Gemini or Virgo, whoever, whoever from your past here, six of cups, this, this eight of wands here, this eight of wands could be coming from a Virgo or a Gemini. One of them is from a Virgo and one of them is from a Gemini. One coming in with a steady uh, offer here, but they moving real slow, but they've been manifesting you. They got their eye on you and you are the one for them. This other communication here is coming from somebody that's from your past that puts you through a whole bunch of shit here and tried to play with your love. Here go the fool though. So here, here comes this leap of faith. All right, Aries is coming towards you. This fool could go one or two ways like I explained to Cancer, okay? You could be a foolish and go back to somebody from your past that played with you, okay? Or you could be a fool and take that leap of faith and go towards somebody new. Show me what's going on with this fool spirit. The tower here, the six of swords. Mm. Walking away from a Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius. Show me more on my place. The fool again, the star. Sheesh. 
whoever this is coming towards you, it could be a strong Aquarius with the fool out here times two with the star. It could be an Aquarius here. Who world is getting up, shaking upside down. Somebody's having a tower walking away from something. What's the tower about? Show me the tower, spirit. Show me the tower for Scorpio. Judgment. Mm. Page of Wands. Mm. The Four of Wands. Baby, whoever this is that's coming towards you, you know it, you smell it, you feel it, and it's coming. Mm, mm, mm. It could be an Aquarius or an Aries that's making their way towards you. They left somebody behind. What's the Six of Swords about? Who is this that got left behind? Six of Pentacles here, the Knight of Wands. It could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn that got left behind. Somebody was a player, though. Somebody was in and out. Show me more. 66 is significant, 88. Show me more. This is why this explains why you got the nine of wands here this is in your challenging position. This person has they this person has the full potential to give you what you want. This person possibly could have a lot of Aries in their chart or a lot of Sagittarius. Uh, I was going to say Sagittarius as well, and also a lot of uh, Aquarius. They look at you as a uh, uh, full potential here. They see like they happy when they're around you. Something about you just brightens this person day. But check this out, okay? This person likes to be spoiled. Um, this person likes to be in control of everything, but they're realizing their ways here. The Six of Swords, the Six of Pentacles here, Knight of Wands. Somebody is definitely leaving somebody behind and coming towards you. They could be leaving behind a, a, a Libra and coming towards you here. They're going to let you know that they was married or something, but it's done. They're coming towards you. This person likes to be spoiled. They like to be in control of things, but they're realizing things that they have to change within themselves, and they're making the necessary step. They're taking the necessary step, Scorpio, to make things right for you. But this came up. This this is your challenging card here with the nine of wands. If you do not set healthy boundaries here and stand on what you say and mean that shit with everything in you, somebody will take you and play you as a fool, okay? This is your challenging position. Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpios. This is what I have for you. Scorpio, strong on Aries out here, okay? Strong on Scorpio, strong on Libra, real strong on Aquarius, okay? Somebody from your past wants you back. Some you've been manifesting, be patient because everything is coming towards you in one walk, okay? This is beautiful. I love you, Scorpios, Cancers, and Pisces. Don't forget to hit that like, the comment, and subscribe button, and I'm going to tap in with y'all later, okay? Protect your PC and energy. Peace.